Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn Class 8 Chapter 1 Rational Numbers Introduction. Let us see what are rational numbers. The numbers which are expressed in the form of P by Q where P and Q are integers and Q value is not equal to 0 are called rational numbers. Set of all rational numbers are denoted by the letter capital letter Q. So example for rational numbers are 1 by 2, 3 by 4, minus 12 by 18 etc. See now we can better understand what are rational numbers by seeing these examples. See now do this question see here consider the following collection of numbers 1 1 by 2 minus 2 0 0.5 4 1 by 2 minus 33 by 7 0 4 by 7 22 minus 5 2 by 19 0 0.125 now all these numbers we have to write under the appropriate category see first one they are given as natural numbers from the given collection of numbers natural numbers are 1 and 22 see now second one whole numbers we all know whole numbers include 0 so along with these natural numbers we include this 0 then it is set of whole numbers so whole numbers here 0 1 and 22 next integers are along with all these whole numbers negative numbers also come under these integers see 0 1 22 minus 5 and minus 2 all these are integers from the given collection of numbers now let us see what are rational numbers. In a given collection, all the numbers come under this rational numbers. Previous definition we have seen, if the numbers are in the P by Q form, then those are called as rational numbers. See here, given all collection of numbers we entered here, those all are rational numbers. 1 means it can be written in the P by Q form as 1 by 1, so it will become a rational number. Next, 1 by 2 is a rational number, minus 2. It can be written as minus 2 by 1. So, it will also become a rational number. See here, decimal number is given 0 0.5. It can be written as 5 by 10. So, then also it becomes a rational number which is in the form of P by Q. Next, 4, 1 by 2. It is a mixed number. This can also be written as a rational number. How? 2, 4, 8, 8 plus 1, 9. So, it becomes 9 by 2. So it is a rational number. Minus 33 by 7 is a rational number. See here 0, 0 can be written as 0 by 1 or 0 by 2. 0 by any number, it becomes 0 only. So it can also become as a rational number. Next 4 by 7 is a rational number. 2 by 19 is a rational number. 22 can be written as 22 by 1. Next minus 5 can be written as minus 5 by 1. Next, 0 0.125 can be written as 125 by 1000. Now, we converted all the numbers in the form of P by Q. So, all these are considered as rational numbers. Is every natural number, whole number and integers are rational numbers? It is a question. Yes, we can say natural numbers, whole numbers, integers all are rational numbers. See, now try these first sum. Hamid says 5 by 3 is a rational number and 5 is only a natural number. Sakshi says both are rational numbers. Who do you agree with? Let us see the solution. I would not agree with Hamid's argument. Why? Because 5 by 3 is a rational number and also 5 is not only a natural number, it is also a rational number. So we agree with Sakshi. Since every natural number is a rational number, according to Sakshi's opinion, 5 by 3 and 5 both are rational numbers. Therefore, I agree with Sakshi's opinion. See now question number 2. Give an example to satisfy the following statements. See the first one. All natural numbers are whole numbers, but all whole numbers need not be natural numbers. Let us see the solution. Yes, all natural numbers are whole numbers. But all whole numbers are not natural numbers. Why? Because 0 is not a natural number but it is a whole number. Therefore, every whole number is not a natural number. 
since natural numbers are subset of whole numbers see now second question second one all whole numbers are integers but all integers are not whole numbers let us see the solution we know whole numbers starts from 0 1 2 3 so on so all these whole numbers are integers but all integers are not whole numbers why because integers consists of all whole numbers that means all positive numbers and also negative numbers which are not present in whole numbers see here minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 so on all the negative numbers are not present in whole numbers so these are not whole numbers but these are integers therefore all whole numbers are integers but all integers are not whole numbers since whole numbers are subset of integers see now second question third one all integers are rational numbers but all rational numbers need not be integers let us see the solution we know integers consists of all positive numbers and negative numbers so all integers are rational numbers but all rational numbers need not be integers why because 2 by 3 7 by 5 etc all these are rational numbers these are not integers therefore we can say all integers are rational numbers but all rational numbers need not be integers since all integers are subset of rational numbers we can say every rational number is not an integer today we have seen class 8 chapter 1 rational numbers what are rational numbers do this and try these sums Hope you all like this video. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.